loves welcome back to my channel and today i'm going to be doing an amazon finds video not too much just um some things i picked up and right now they're like my faves so i just wanted to share it with you so first i'm going to be showing you my makeup box this is the Vanessa brand makeup box and i actually thought it was a lot bigger when i seen it on amazon but it happened to be smaller but that's okay because I don't have that much makeup anyway so it is good for me and I probably should have took all the stuff out first before showing you but this is how the inside looks so it is about four compartments five compartments two on each side and then in at the bottom there's a wider area for you to place your bigger items and like I said there's not much in here because I don't have a lot of makeup so this is good for me but if you have tons of makeup this may not be good for you you may need to purchase something bigger this was about $26 and it comes in handy it comes with a lock if you want to lock it I don't find this part necessary for me because I will be keeping this box at home but if you want to travel you may want to lock it so it is cute I needed some way to put my makeup because I just had my makeup honestly in like a plastic bag stuck at the bottom of the closet and I'm trying to be a bit more organized so I purchased this and the next thing I got was a black Canon camera bag and this bag fits my Canon EOS R with the 24-105 lens perfectly and it has extra space if I want to carry around a extra lens or the flash so my camera and the lens alone fits here and I can just add something else in this compartment and at first I wasn't going to get a bag because my camera comes with a strap so I held it that way and then I thought about it this camera is pretty expensive so I better get a bag to carry it around and this is not too bulky this is just right for when I am traveling the next thing I want to show you is this jewelry hanger that I purchased and this just made things a lot more convenient okay the way I stored my custom jewelry before was not okay I would leave whatever store I purchased the jewelry from, H&M, Forever 21. I would leave it in that bag and that's how I stored my jewelry before. And I just had to get, to get it together, okay? I had to get it together. So I purchased me a jewelry hanger. And on this side, this is for the longer pieces. It has like hooks so you can hang the longer pieces of your jewelry. And then on this side, it's like little pockets. So you can put your, your chains and your bracelets, your earrings, your inklets, all in the pockets. So this is a lot more convenient and organized for me. So here is a mic. I've been getting a lot of questions about this. This is the mic that I use in my videos for better audio quality. And I just snap it on my shirt and tuck it away while I try to hide it. I'm pretty sure y'all see it in my videos. I try to hide it under my shirt. Um, this is a lot more inexpensive than the name brand. I think it's Rode or R-O-D-E brand that everyone is using. So I saw this on another YouTuber's page and I just had to get it. Like I said, I am new to YouTube so I don't want to spend a bunch of money on top notch equipment at the moment. So I got this and this works just fine. I would have it on now but I think the battery is dead. <laughs> so I have to get a new battery. But yeah, this is inexpensive, easy to work with. You just clip it on your shirt and connect it to your camera and you're good to go. The next product that I purchased from Amazon is the A.O. Dillon for Canon. 
This is a wireless remote control. And this is very useful when it comes to taking my thumbnail pictures. I don't always have my husband or my sons to come and snap a picture for me. I use the remote. I just hold it in my hand and I can just click away and take pictures. It comes with an AF mode and a W and a T, which I don't know what those two things are for. But, yeah, it's very small and convenient. I can also take my own selfies and I'm good to go. Yes, this camera does have a timer on it, but instead of me just running back and forth to press the timer, I hold this in my hand and just click away. It's very convenient. And I got this Brilliant Evolution LED Wireless Light. It comes with three batteries and it came in a set of two. So I placed these in my closet, one on each side, and it just brightens up my closet and makes everything more easy to see. I do have a light on the outside of my closet, but it's not bright enough, so this helps a lot. I think I'm gonna purchase some more to put under my cabinets, and you can use it to put anywhere that's dark and you need that extra light. I advise you to get these. These come with adhesive that you can, you know, just stick it to the wall, or I think it gives you the option to nail it to the wall as well. So, these are very useful around the house where you need extra light. I also purchased some Waverly Matte Finish Acrylic Paint. You guys that have been watching me know I like to do a little bit of arts and crafts, so this comes in handy. But even if you're not like that much into arts and crafts and you just want to revamp something such as a vase or even a mason jar, you can easily paint this and add some cute flowers and there go your centerpiece for your coffee table or your dinner table. I just love the way that white chalk paint gives your furniture or your decor a rustic benches type of look. Now moving on to the new trend. I know you all been watching TikTok. It is like the biggest entertainment while we all home quarantine. So I then got onto the new trend. Yes, I have the whip coffee, the Delgado coffee. And I done went and got me a frother. What is it? Frother? Frother. <laughs> I done went and got me a frother, guys. Look. It is like my favorite coffee now. Mind you, I never used to like cold coffee. I always like hot coffee. But since this, tasting this, I love it. And if you don't drink coffee, this can be used to mix drinks as well. So keep that in mind. Another thing that I got was the Scott Pro Thermal Laminator. And I got this for arts and craft reasons, but you can use a laminator for numerous of things. Number one is to keep your documents more intact. We all know that paper and cardstock is easily, you know, destroyed and can rip with no problem. So I like to keep my documents, my important documents, laminated so they do not get messed up. Go get you one. And lastly, <laughs> I purchased me some blue UV light glasses. Okay, I told you guys not too long ago that I've been getting headaches nonstop. And it's because I've been sitting in front of my computer. I've been on the phone, I've been watching a bit of TV, and that takes a toll on my eyes, which affects my head, and I start to get headaches. So I ordered me some UV blue light glasses. And this is how they look. It might be a little foggy, because I, I can see that's foggy, actually. Nice and nerdy. <laughs> And it came in a set of three. So that is like the leopard print one. And then it also comes with these pink ones. And 
and it comes with a transparent color as well which I gave to my eldest son and my youngest son has a pair as well it didn't come in this box a separate pair and with a strap yeah because us sitting in front of these TVs all the time that can take a toll on your head <laughs> And that is it for this Amazon Finds video. I am going to link everything down below. So if you are interested in anything you've seen in this video, I got you. See you later.